Lately I've been working with Boxermat 84, that's Jay Rothwell from England, on a couple of his planes, the Alpha Jet and the F-16 here. One thing I noticed was that his 2200 motor that he had uh, sounded like it was spooling up very, very quickly. It was uh, sounded more powerful than the Microjet. Um, so we come to find out that he's using the EMP props. I've got the APC props that I normally use, and he uses the uh, EMP. Right off the bat, I see that the bite of the 6x4 APC looks a lot be uh, a bigger bite. It's got uh, more of an angle on the prop right around the hub, uh, whereas it looks like the EMP prop is um, the same kind of angle, but it doesn't have that bite right here. Both batteries have 12.6 volts, so I'm going to start off with one 12.6 volt battery and do a run with that. Then I'll switch to the other 12.6 volt battery. Uh, that's a, you know a three cell battery at 12.6 volts. Fifty-three point five. Thirty-six point four miles per hour. Thirty-six point four. That's going into the breeze. So we'll do one with the breeze again. Fifty-three point eight miles per hour. Fifty-three point eight. Thirty-eight point four into the breeze. I'm gonna do some fun flying just to get an impression of the A APC prop. Awesome thrust vectoring. Okay, battery's fading out. All right, I've got the EMP prop on here now. One thing I noticed was that there's a little bit of slop in the spacer. Um, I've chosen the spacer that is uh, right for the shaft, but the first time I put it on, there's some vibration, so I had to uh, adjust for that. But 53.8 was the highest speed I got with the APC. I've got, like I said, a 3S battery. <laughs> All right, 49.9. into the wind. miles per hour. All right, 53.7. Forty point zero into the wind. Do one more. All right, fifty three point eight. So I don't see any difference in speed. Let's see about the maneuvering. Feels like I swear the speed from this prop is a little bit more consistent through the whole throttle range. It's almost as if the APC needs a little bit of RPMs to get spooled up and start delivering thrust, whereas this seems to have thrust immediately. One thing I'm noticing is uh, seems to be a little bit longer flight time with this prop. It was about this time that the APC was. Uh, the battery was drained.
still got some juice in this. I'm going to have to check the video to see what the flight time is. Seems like it's about two minutes longer than the other so far, than the APC. Well, after that test, I'll definitely be giving the EMP props a, a shot. Um, what I notice is that the thrust is immediate. As soon as, uh, like from quarter throttle up, you've got thrust coming off the EMP, whereas the APC, you need to get over half throttle before the thrust starts kicking in. Um, I do a lot of high alpha flying, so I'm going to be, uh, when it's a calm day, I'm, I'm going to be putting this on the MiG-29, do some high alpha, also the alpha jet when I get that repaired, and see how the high alpha benefits from that.